According to the National Institute of Mental Health, 4.4% of the adult population are diagnosed with Attention Deficit Hyperactive Disorder, also known as ADHD. ADHD is a qualified mental health handicap, while I view it personally as a superpower when harnessed correctly. My family has a very strong history of ADHD, and we've learned how to cope with the different side effects and issues that come from ADHD and actually turn them into advantages. Today I'll be talking about those side effects and how hiring someone or being someone with ADHD can actually be an advantage in the business world. Now, according to healthline.com, the three main disadvantages or downfalls of ADHD are inattention, hyperactivity, and impulsivity. While much of the world will view this as a handicap, I view it as a major benefit and asset to you and your company. Inattention is something that is very hard to overcome. And most people with ADHD are not good at bookkeeping, are not organized, are not um, put together. For this, the best way to overcome this problem is just to hire the right people to fill that position because it will free up your time to grow the business. ADHD people will not make good accountants. They will not make good um, secretaries. They can oftentimes be scatterbrained because they are thinking of bigger and better things. They aren't good at getting caught up in the little details. So personally, the only real way that I've found around this is being willing to hire or find the right people to fill those positions in your life or in your business. People with ADHD can be extremely successful in the field that they are interested in because of their ability to hyper-focus, which allows them to work on a problem with extreme focus until the problem is complete um, or resolved. People with ADHD are more prone to, to risks and have a good ability to recognize opportunity when they notice it. Because you get so enthralled with a field, you become a master. And someone with ADHD has the ability to spend hours and hours studying and working on um, things that they are interested in. Impulsivity can oftentimes be viewed as a bad thing because you fire first and then you aim. In the world of business, you need in the world of business, you t sometimes need to act fast and people will miss opportunities because they're too busy thinking about it. A good business person knows how to act and respond to that action. People will rationalize things too much and not just act. Oftentimes people are too scared to dive into things and to get their hands dirty because they are worried about the risk. People with ADHD um, are willing to take those risks because they know that they're, if there's it's something they're interested in, they can become very, very successful and knowledgeable in that field. ADHD gives you the access to unlimited amount of energy, which propels you to do more work in a day. When I am personally interested in a business or an idea, I will spend hours researching it, and sometimes I'll even reach 3 a.m. without even noticing the time. Um, this drive and motivation makes a very knowledgeable person in their respective industries. I found that I'm a, a well-rounded person, and I can talk about many different uh ideas and businesses because I've spent a lot of time researching different ideas and different businesses and I'm not afraid to ask questions when I don't know. Time is something that everybody has the same amount of. If you can learn how to maximize it, you will have a head start on the majority of people. Finally, ADHD should not be viewed as a negative. It should be viewed as unlimited potential. The key is learning how to harness that power and unlocking your full potential in the business world. ADHD can be crippling if you do not take the proper steps to understand how to channel that in energy into produ productivity. I think, I think once someone with ADHD learns how to do that, they become some of the most valuable people on the planet and definitely a person you would want on your team.